Elementary students in Perry are back in class as the district begins its transition back to school after a deadly school shooting earlier this month. Details in our top story this afternoon at 5. 11-year-old Amir Jolliffe and a Perry High School principal Dan Marburger died in that shooting. That's when 17-year-old, a 17-year-old opened fire in the cafeteria back on January 4th. Now, kids were having breakfast there before the start of school that day. Today, elementary students held classes for the first time since that day. The district is adding more uniformed officers and more adults inside the buildings. Counselors and mental health support also were on hand today. Heartland Education AEA telling us that the transition back to school is a difficult one. But we will have a team on site again as schools open um, just to help with everything from, you know, people will be um, maybe nervous about coming back for that first day and helping them just transition into the building. We will be there um, for that short term support that we've been providing the whole time. So you'll see. Um, Heartland AEA staff members there in a variety of roles, just helping ease that transition process back into the building. Middle school students return to the classroom tomorrow. Meanwhile, high school students won't go back to school until next Wednesday.